Hello everyone, in this video uh, I'm gonna show you how you can use Ajax in Drupal 8 version. So, uh, the easy way to use Ajax in Drupal 8 is uh, it's a more, uh, is to use uh, one module, what's called Drupal 8 simple Ajax call. Uh, so, just go on this page uh, after download this one open go to your folder module simple OX call close also this is my website so I go to extend uh, go and find the plug module. Sorry. Oh, on my case is uh, just it's already activated because I activated before and I deleted. So it just activates and install and um, that's it. So the fifth way is go on the bottom it say activate create a file in your term called function okay copy this one uh, okay it's not this folder okay so I'm going to my module uh, my template tennis uh, business this is my team so in this folder uh, I'm going to create a file I'll call it function finish so it say me blah 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 close save so I, I create a page uh, blog I add simple page and um, what the ID of this page is number 8 so I'm going to go to my template well, I already create this one and uh, I add some kind of Ajax code this but it's not it's not the right thing so go back to github uh, it say my Ajax well, let's try to download uh, copy this one mm, let's do false false so what is say it said to me ID uh, go to my post I'm gonna go to my post content and look on my content and I'll find article 7 uh, where is the node ID of this article is number seven. So what I'll do I'll just try to extract this content uh, to uh, and show. So just ID seven. I need just ID seven. Uh, oh, it's say oh this is str whatever I don't need this one uh, just 7 so I'll just send simple data but you can uh, uh, take the data from form or from anything else so I query my function my function I'll call the function um, just uh, um, get article 
content content go back to my function create this function function keep the same name and uh, let's return something for example uh, let's go back and uh, have a look this is a small explanation so it say I can I, I, I can take the ID basically so this is a simple post uh, or I'm gonna use I'll I'm gonna use just a simple you can do extract something like this or you can use something like um, something like this I use that so echo and show the post ID ID and point so save uh, what's gonna happen? okay I'll need this my slot function wherever you could rename this one so lot content content and go to, to this one so Ajax test Ajax go here okay go back for one more thing uh, go to configuration after when in G when you install uh, any modules on Drupal 8 you have to clear the cache this is the most important thing so account settings performance it say clear all cache okay let's do this I say successful so update our page uh, go this one okay so return okay something something getting wrong just let me check this one lot content Okay, everything is alright. Uh, so something really getting wrong. I don't understand why it's getting wrong. Okay. So probably I I ask targets HTML data so limit function post call Ajax now let me check if this one is working open this one this function is ok everything is working fine oh geez some kind of problem with, uh, with I believe with jQuery so it's say something getting wrong let me try oh. let me try make a simple test where is getting wrong update ok well I believe that is the jQuery I have to import any library so I only need some kind of library jQuery any jQuery library to import all my so 
So, whatever. Uh, let's try this one. Uh, the function get article content it doesn't exist. Okay, so why does it exist this one? Of function. Okay, I I lost G. Uh, uh, update. So. Oh, I got the uh, transfer was ID number seven. So the problem was because the jQuery is uh, already not included in my on my page. Uh, in this case, I just try to create add this by itself. You can do this. Um, simple way, simple and easy way to do something like this or uh, go to library oh uh, it say this jQuery triple IAX where is the I'm checking on the code jQuery Okay, I believe the problem was because the jQuery is on the bottom. So let me try the next one. So use this one, something like this. Probably work, probably not, but let's try it. Delete this one with the knees. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's right. It's working. So we're gonna use something like this. It doesn't accept dollar. On the front is um, accept by default jQuery. Whatever. Uh, that is a good news. Oh, we go. So let's extract content. Uh, let's go back to. We don't need this anymore. Or we don't need need this one. Um. So let's take this one. Enter. ID where ID is small, let's make equal equal so limits we, we will need limits in my case is one if I only need one and do, 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 everything is working fine so let's try body value body value that's when we extract the, just only the content so let's press. Oh, okay. I go. I go. Everything. So the good news is you may use something like this and uh, Drupal and traits and basically everything is all perfect. Um, it's easy. And perfect is something like you know, um, something like not far from WordPress. So this is it. Use your Ajax, but try when you try to create a function, try to use jQuery in front and not dollar. So that's it guys. It's easy, it's simple. And bye. See you next video.